uh, to help us push back against this uh, pandemic. Uh, under the President's leadership this week, we've taken two important steps. First, as President Trump announced on Wednesday, the United States and Canada jointly agreed to restrict all non-essential traffic across our border. This decision goes into effect tonight at midnight. The restrictions will be reviewed after 30 days, uh, and they exclude traffic and movement across the border for work or other essential reasons. We're grateful to have such an outstanding friend to the North who is committed, as we are, to defeating this virus. Uh, I also want to announce today uh, that the United States and Mexico have agreed to restrict non-essential travel across our shared border. Both our countries know the importance uh, of working together to limit the spread of the virus and ensure that uh, commerce that supports our economy continues to keep flowing. Uh, here, too, the United States is uh, glad to have a friend who's working si side by side us in the fight. Uh, Secretary uh, Wolf will talk a little bit more about the details of how we're working alongside our partner in Mexico to keep our southern border safe and secure as well. Uh, on another note, yesterday the State Department issued a Level 4 Global Travel Advisory. This means that all international travel from U.S. citizens should be avoided. In countries where commercial departure options remain available, U.S. citizens who reside in the United States should arrange for immediate return to the United States unless they're prepared to remain abroad for an extended time. If you choose to travel internationally, your travel plans may well be severely disrupted.